And we're back to learning GIMP and this time I'm going to show you how to create an anaglyphic text effect. It's a little bit different compared to adding it to photo. But first we need some text, so I use the type tool, you can also press T for that, I press Ctrl A. And I change the font, you want to have a bold font. And I use an italic style, I size it up, you can also use the italic function down here, but search for an inbuilt italic font, that way you can be sure that the font doesn't get skewed by GIMP. Now use the line tool, left click on it and I put it in center. For this to work, I've got it set to relative to image. You can also scale it up if it's still too small. I hold control when I do with the scale tool. Now I need two copies, so I need three in total. Top one is going to be black. I go to the second one and now you can't use the type tool on it anymore as I've scaled it up. So we use the bucket fill tool to change the color. For colors, just copy my hex code here. You want to have some bluish turquoise color and a pink color. For turquoise, I use 06 DDE3. Confirm it and then left click with the bucket fill tool on the letters. You can add the color directly via the type tool if you haven't scaled it up. But this is what I've got to do here. Now I go to the bottom one. I use my pink color. FF027A. Confirm, left click on your letters. Now I'll make them all visible again. I go to the pink one, left click on it, and then I use the arrow keys. And then I use the arrow keys to the left. And for turquoise, I go to the right. Once again, I have to click on the canvas before I can use the arrow keys. And now if I zoom out, it looks like we've got this typical anaglyphic text effect. Finally, I can merge these layers. And then we're good. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.